my last tube of callus caviar. I wonder if Japan IKEA has callus. Pastries, cooler looking pastries, gingerbread, cinnamon rolls, dime, good old candy. Is that licorice? Ugh. Ooh, cheese doodles. I'm guessing cookies for Fika. Even more chocolate. More Fika stuff. Beer. Oh! Wait, is there callous caviar? Eh? They don't have callus? Why would you have crispy bread without any callous caviar? the system works here is that you see the menu then you go up to the mic and then you tell the staff what your order is sausage and I want a fried chicken you I've always been intrigued by this plant balls. It's a running joke because I don't like vegetables and my friends keep trying to make me eat this. Here goes. It's actually not bad. Pretty strong potato taste in it. But it I think it's 80% at least like the real thing. Lingonberry jam, gravy, mashed potatoes, it'll always be good. Now let's go for some real meatball. Twisted. Could be crispier. Not quality potato. Sweet and IKEA have better potatoes. It smells very good. <laughs> a little bit on the dry side, if you ask me, but all in all, I'm pretty pleased with it. Better than KFC, in my opinion. So in my opinion, this is not quite worth it because there's only like 100 grams of meat. But the meat itself looks pretty good. Not fully cooked, which is good. Leading on the medium rare side, maybe. It's got garlic sauce, smells pretty good. It's very tender. My only complaint is that 100 grams is definitely not enough. But the price they're selling it at would be nicer if they could lower it a little bit. My favorite lobster bisque. So good. So every time I go to an IKEA here in Japan, I order this. Just normal sausage. Smells good. 
I think the casing is a little bit too thick. Flavor-wise, again, not much of an issue. Quite big, the sausage. For scale. Here's my hand. I don't think overseas IKEA has fried chicken. It looks pretty nice and juicy inside. Normal, basic, above average, crispy, Japanese, karaoke, fried chicken. I have one cinnamon roll in my life. And it was made by my Swedish friend's mom. It was a homemade cinnamon roll. It was really good. I have high expectations. Halter bun would definitely have been better. Maybe because the one I had was heated. Pretty hard. Like, our cinnamon roll is supposed to be this hard. It's really hard. You can hear it, right? Tearing it apart, though, you can see that they do have enough, like, flavor on the inside, I guess. Mm. Good dessert. I would eat this for breakfast, maybe. But it's dry. But if I had to order this, I would definitely need a drink. The good thing about IKEA is, you know how in a lot of restaurants you can't order kids' menu? Here you can. No one really like you know says you can't. So I ordered the kids' menu for the clam balls. But with that kids' plate came this. It's a uh, kids jelly it specifically says kids jelly and it's peach so let's see it's very watery like ooh. there's more water than jelly here it's all water mediocre a little bit artificial taste there's absolutely no ingredient label or anything on it nutritional label so i don't know what's inside this i don't know why it's so watery Tastes more like cognac than jelly. If you're at IKEA and your highlight or your aim is to eat peach jelly, you're doing it wrong. So I guess this doesn't matter that much, but it's edible. So I'll finish eating it. I think I've been to IKEA like four times this month. Whoops. 